Hey guys, so today we're gonna to be filming a brand new video. And today we're gonna to be filming with the new Lizzie McGuire and ColourPop collection. And of course, I'm super excited to show you guys this little look. So if you wanna see how this look turns out, then just keep on watching. Show you guys everything close up. So I just want to show you guys, this is the blush. We're going to be going into the blush a little bit later, but I just want to show you guys the products. So this is the blush. This is in the shade UR. This is the blush shade I ended up picking up. This is the eyeshadow palette. This is the What Dreams Are Made Of Press Powder palette. This is the box. This is the adorable palette. Look how cute. And then everything's lifted right here, so it feels really cool. And I just want to show you guys, these are the colors. Look how pretty these shades are. Let's get make sure y'all get all up in there. So pretty. And then look at the little mirror. I'm gonna try to like not blind you guys. See little Lizzie right there? Isn't she so cute? And this whole collection, I just had to pick this up. So cute. I mean, come on, like the all the detail in this palette and the whole collection. Alright, you guys, so I applied some eyeshadow base, and of course, I wanted to put my hair up in these little like little butterfly moments. I think they're super cute, and it's definitely the vibe. So I wanted to go in with those little butterflies. And then of course the tie-dye on tie-dye for like, it's a really good little moment. Like, okay tie-dye moment. Okay, so it's a whole little vibe. And today I'm also gonna be showing you guys, I'm gonna be showing you guys two looks in this video. So I'm gonna be showing you guys like a freehand, like I'm just gonna create and whatever I, I create, I create with this look today. I haven't done yet, but I wanna do a little look with the little um, pom-poms, like that little shade in here. Don't freak, like this shape, these two shades right here is the whole vibe tomorrow. The two looks in one. So I just feel like we should just dive right in. Like I think I'm just, I'm ready to dive into this. So I kind of want to dip into this shade, ugh, first. It's like really pretty, like almost like a, it's just like a really pretty blushy pink. And we're just going to start off with that. I'm not going to put it here in the inner corner. I'm just going to like put it like right here in this area because I want to add that lime green right there in the inner corner. I feel like that is going to be like my main center part. And I just want to apply this all over. And I'm going to dip into this shade called Done and Done. I'm just going to use that to blend. Blend it out. Look at that shade called Alpha Repeater Satin Matte. It has like a little bit of shimmer in there. And we're going to pop that right here. This little spot right here. Again, over that. Just to get a seamless blend. Now we're going to be dipping into that shade digital bean that purple shade we're going to go in here with a smaller brush this is the morphe m456 we're just going to pop that here in the outer part and we're just going to start bringing this up slowly this one is just like freehand like whatever i'm feeling i'm just kind of like going with the flow how i feel um i didn't really have i don't have a look in mind i was just super excited i just i just got this today and i'm like oh yeah we're doing a look today. I don't care what it is. So I didn't plan anything. I'm kind of just playing with the palette today. And then tomorrow I do have a look planned and in mind, like I said, with the lime look. That really pretty blush tone right here. And I'm just using still that and I'm using that to blend out that purple shade. Because that shade is like really pigmented. I actually really like that um, uh, shade. It reminds me of that color I used uh, in the Hello Kitty video. The uh, shade BFF. I don't know what's up with me in those tones right now, but I'm really loving it. I'm gonna dip into this shade called So Mature, So Mature. And it's like an also like another coral type of color. And I wanna add that right here in this little spot right here before I add the lime, just to add more color, you know what I mean? Why not? I wanna kinda use like almost every shade in here. So, which I probably won't, but you know. Okay, now we're gonna dip into my favorite shade I think is gonna be in here and that shade called Don't Freak. And we're just gonna pop that here in the inner corner part. Like, hello. Hi queen, how are you? I love seeing little Lizzie here in the mirror. Oh, she looks so cute. Start bringing her under here. And I'm gonna go back into that shade called Digital Bean, that purple. We're just going to tap into a little bit of that and we're just, just going to start smoking it out like a little wing moment. Love this color. I honestly, I love every color that's in here. Like, it's so vibrant. Like, ooh, 
this is a vibe like this is a whole neon fantasy like you're crazy if you don't like this palette oh you're crazy i'm just going to continue going in with that purple and i'm just going to add this under here in the lower lash line so you want to have that little space because y'all know what i've been doing lately i think y'all guys been noticing i've been going in with like a shade and just kind of like adding it in the middle i'm going to go in with that with the shade called so mature so mature and i'm going to go in here i'm just going to use this shade right here in the center since i didn't really get to use this shade too much in the look look just like that and then what i'm going to do is going to drag this down because like I said, I don't know why I've been doing this, but I've been loving like a, an eye that I just drag down. Yeah, just gonna add, add a little bit of that and then you just wanna go into your finger and then like dust it off a little bit. It kind of gives you like a really cool effect. Kind of reminds me of the package. I mean, it really does. I mean, I mean I, you know what? I didn't even swatch any shades, but maybe we'll swatch here in a little bit, but yeah, let's do a little bit of shimmer moment because I feel like we need some shimmers. shimmers. So we have here Outfit Repeater and I'm going to swatch these two shades right here. Outfit Repeater, oh no, Outfit Remember and Hello Fabulous. So we're going to swatch these really quick just so I can see. So we have a purple and a pink, that orange, these two shimmers right here. Got a bright orange and then like a lime highlighter color, which you already know is one of my favorite shades in here. Hey, Dear Diary, it's that little lime. And we're just going to pack this on right here please that shade that glitter or probably you know what let me go with that shade fabulous hello fabulous that purple shade first i'm gonna add that right here now we have like a purple and lime highlighter and then i'm gonna go in with that that glitter and that's that really pretty please and we're just gonna add that right on top so i just wanted to like at least play with some shimmers so i can show you guys like how they feel and how they work on my eyes or what i wanted to do I didn't really know which ones I was going to end up going in with, but I feel like the end result is super cute. So I'm going to go to the other half camera. I might end up fixing this a little bit in this little blend moment because um, it looks a little, a little messy right here. But I'm just going to go finish the other eye off camera and I'll be right back. Alright guys, so this ended up being the final product. I ended up just adding like some little flowers. Now we're gonna go in here with some blush. I'm super excited to go in with this blush. Honestly, I didn't really care for the um, the fact that it has shimmer in here because I'm really more of a matte person. I'm gonna be honest with you guys, but you know, I got it anyways because it's super cute. So I'm gonna go in with this one. I'm just gonna first apply this on the nose because I feel like we need a blushy moment, of course. Ooh. So I'm just going to go in here with apply a little bit of this. Of course, I already applied a couple of this on my my TikTok. But this is actually a really pretty color. I actually like this a lot more than I thought I was going to like it. Because, oh, hold on, I'm looking at my phone camera. Okay, I'm going to apply it on this side so you guys can see how it looks without the blush. So you can see your first impressions on it. Of course, very pigmented. I'm, I'm gonna go crazy with the blush because, hello, this is 2000 themed. Well, as far as blush, and I feel like the bright colors and the clips, it's a whole little 2000s look. So, it's very vibrant. We're just gonna kind of like blend this little area here. And we should be good. All right, so I'm gonna go apply some lashes and finish off the rest of this look, and then I'll be right back for the next one. All right, guys, so this is the final look. Oh my God, I'm loving this look. It's so freaking cute. I love the way this palette turned out. I honestly, if you guys didn't get your hands on it, I honestly suggest you guys pick it up. For like a Disney fan, I love ColourPop's Disney collections. I didn't pick up like a couple of the other ones, but this one was like one like I needed to have in my collection. It's super cute. And also the blush was really adorable too. I love this whole little collection. It's really just my vibe. So now I'm just going to show you guys my next look for tomorrow. So if you guys want to see that, obviously just keep on watching.
that is the end of this video if you guys love these two looks i created for you guys and of course if you did like this video make sure to give it a big thumbs up and comment down below any video suggestions you have for me and of course if no one told you you're beautiful you're beautiful okay bye guys awesome.